Hello everyone. Today I'm in Volkswagen EF second generation and uh, I wanted to show you something. Before uh, that I would like to just to clarify that the second generation car have a bigger battery, twice the capacity of the, the first generation and bigger or more charging also twice the capacity of the previous generation which means the onboard charging is 7.2 kilowatts and the battery is 36.8 kilowatt hours and this is currently the second time i'm charging the car on the dc fast charging station you can see here i'm at the abb factory which is one of the biggest uh, factory for uh, dc fast charging and they have a free charging service here and i have plugged the car to charge it and let me show you what you can experience when you uh, charge the car for a second time let's just uh, this noise to turn off you can see 4.4 hours and 10 minutes i need to dc fast charge the car and this is because the car is rapid gating what the rapid gating means is that the car is limiting the charging current because it doesn't have an active uh, cooling or heating the battery the only way the car can uh, limit the temperature of the battery is when it limits the charging current when you are doing a DC fast charging so in this case the car is limiting the charging current and I need to be here for about four hours to fully charge the car let me show you something else this is this is the uh, obd 11 that i used to monitor the car and you can see here this is the battery temperature it is 50 degree and uh, i think the threshold is uh, 46 degree whenever this happens 45 or 46 degree the car onboard charging is starting to limit the current of the dc fast charge you can see here that i'm charging with around uh, 10 kilowatts it's less than 10 kilowatts and the car is limiting the the charging current to 41 amp in order to uh, just not increase the temperature of the battery below some threshold uh, so these are the the stats from the charging when i arrived here i was at six or seven percent i be i'm here for 15 or 20 minutes let's go to the charger to see what's the stats there okay i don't know if you can see it i'm here for 18 minutes and i have managed to deliver 3.6 kilowatts so if we multiply that by how many by two by three I will get around 10 kilowatt per one hour of charging which is how to say insane I don't didn't expect that the, the rapid gating of the new car will happen so soon so that's it then you know what to expect from from this car if you are doing uh, DC fast charging the second time consider that you can wait for a long time all right that's it for this very short video if you like it give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel see you soon